Hey guys, how's it going? We are back again playing some Westland Survival. How are we going? Hope you guys are all well. Right, so we're going to get to it. I want to go up north because I need a few bits and pieces, items, things like that. But I want to go up to the snowy region, so we're going to go ahead and get underway. So, I wanted to sort of show you this real quickly before we get going. Finally upgraded the forge, not a massive feat, but... I just wanted to show you that once we get the new materials uh, being, well, that's another one, uh, cocking, coking, coal, I have no idea what that is, so please uh, don't butcher me on that one there, the pronunciation, durable leather, leather belt and alloy plate, we will get the confederate sabre back and the bayonet knife back, I cannot wait to get those two weapons, so excited, anyway, haven't upgraded anything else unfortunately still trying to get um well forever trying to get ash planks which has been such a massive massive grind and the amount of ash that you can get uh, when you're in the zone there uh not a lot you can only get 15 logs and you've got to run out and jump over what uh to another zone what i've been doing is i've been going between uh this one and this one to get uh granite and um i believe it's uh chromite uh or so uh, once I need to get um, a steel happening, I can, I've got a healthy supply and I can get that um, on the way. So yeah, little things here and there that I'm doing at the moment. So just thought I'll just let you know what I'm up to with that one there, but uh, we'll get to it and we'll head down, or sorry, head on up, I should say, uh, to the Northern Zone here. And I just want to take apart a few of the um, basalt, uh, nodes and things like that just so I've got a little bit of supply happening as well and I know a lot of a uh, few other people have asked this uh, back in the past as well so I just thought I thought I'd do this for you guys as well today and yeah check it out alrighty so let's get underway so basically you'll find that there's a ton of basalt here which is good re uh, reasonable supply for that matter so uh, let's get on that and there's also a bit of iron which is um, another resource that is required when you're getting into the later game stage so yeah if you see iron my suggestion is um, go ahead and grab it um, it's definitely needed so as you can see the confederate saber one hit wonder you guys are not going to stand a chance here. And I'm on the XP boost as well, so I'll be able to... Um, I'll be able to gain a little bit of XP while I'm in the zone, so... I mean, I should really probably do a lot better. Oh, go away, outlaw. Do you have anything interesting? I'll take that. Um, yeah, so... Um, it will have an impact on you, so you may... You know start to lose durability obviously on weapons but also on armor so just be careful but if you're quick um, you'll be able to uh, quite easily make your way through the zone and not have a problem about being bothered just obviously watch the durability on the confederate saber as well at the same time so i guess that's something else that you sort of need to worry about but also you will run the risk of of course um, increasing your um your bandit level as well so yeah be very very careful and as you can see there doing a sneak attack 619 damage on my spec build here at the moment so yeah pretty decent i would say so i just want to sort of run over to this fella here someone's coming at me goodbye let's take out this iron deposit here Node, whatever you guys want to call it really and let's just break apart that direwolf no more and let's get the basalt over here as well and of course there are a few other little things here so you've got the uh, plantago you've got the berries and if you're quick enough you'll be able to get these guys one hit hey what are you doing mr lynx and yeah, sorry for that little glitch in time there, but that's alright. We'll keep moving on. But of course, if you obviously run out and if you 
you know, take in everything that you need to. You obviously just run out of the zone, go to the closest one, and just run back in. And we'll, we'll probably end up doing that as well. Sort of make multiple trips. Use your horse to your advantage as well. That's pretty easy, pretty simple, guys. I think you would know this well enough. But what you need as a prerequisite to come up here as well is obviously warm clothing. So um, it is a grind to ensure that you've got enough uh, you know, armor and equipment before you head up this way as well. Especially when you have to unblock the, uh, the snowy passageway as well. And once you've done that, obviously, you've got that accessibility to go over and, yeah, have ac um, access to the north, which is a good zone, a good lot, lot of zones here. Oh, Alright, so we switched over to the steel pickaxe. And now we uh, obviously just making our way through and just making sure that we're not being taken apart here. And with that being said, I mean, um, I would actually thought, well, I would have thought that some of the um, newer resources would have been, you know, up through this way, as opposed down to the south here, which sort of begs the question, where are they going to put the newer resources when they eventually become available? So, I absolutely have no idea, obviously, so I just thought I'd just roll to, to you guys, the crowd here, and see what you think. But let me know in the comments section down below. So anyway, um, how have you guys been progressing with uh, the new update and getting all the new resources? Have you um, accessed all the level 3 workstations, waiting for level 4? And have you uncovered everything? I'm interested to know. I'm also interested to know the uh, the armor, well, uh, the, the next armor up from... Uh, superior armor. That's what I'm. That's what I'm wanting to know. Have you guys got an idea what that is? Let me know in the comments because I'm interested to know. Want to see what will be the next tier level? But again, um, with that being said, as I said before, I wanted to sort of touch on where would they put these new resources? Like I said, I would have thought that a lot of these, uh, the current resources that we just recently got. Could have made its way over to um, you know the north here, you know where we are now. But uh, you know, obviously they made it, made a call and popped it over down south, and yeah, that's where we've got them at the moment. So, which begs the question: Will they open up newer parts of the over map, and will we have um, complete newer zones to find uh, more resources? So that's what I'm sort of hoping on. And um, I'm hoping that the game will get expanded from that alone. So we don't know when this will happen. Um, we are heading towards the end of um, October at the moment. So usually ne um, next month they do some sort of update. It might be a minor update. Who knows? It should be, I believe, the whole character customization. I would imagine. So I think, you know, they've teased that for long enough and I think that would be the next update. So it wouldn't necessarily be, you know, um, game expansion, you know, in regards to new zones and um, other bits and pieces. And look, they might even do so, who knows, but I'm just thinking out loud here. And I'll let you guys let me know in the comments what you think as well. Uh, do you have the same thought process here or do you have something completely different? Or is it that I've missed something um, in translation, you know, whether that be on the developer um, Facebook page or even through the Discord server of Westland Survival. So let me know. And if you guys have any other insights, I'll be um, quite interested to know. And yeah, that'll keep me well informed and I'll be able to um, you know, let everyone else know. Or if anyone else wants to read through the comments, they'll be able to check it out as well. So yeah. If you guys are in the know, let me know. That's basically the way it goes, I guess. 
So let me just break down this guy here and we'll see if we're right with things. So we got 57. Decent amount, just for one, you know, zone run. So I don't think there's any more that we can sort of find. I would think there would be at least one more. One more node somewhere. It's going to give us like an even 60. So I'm just going to sort of quickly make my way around. And I better actually heal up. That'll be a smart thing to do. There we go. And I'm hoping that, yeah, there should be at least one more. Unless I'm missing something. Ah, oh, there we go. Alright, let's just take out this goon here. And that's it. So that's basically one decent run. And you've got 60. So yeah, if you guys are, are in the need of basalt, this is the place to get it. And all that you need to do now is to run into another zone, run back, and the, the zone resets and away we go again. So what's closer? This would be closer, I would imagine. Much, much closer. 22, 17, 21, 17, and 35, 27. So you probably just want to run over here or use uh, ride over, run over, whichever way you want to do it. Doesn't really matter which way you sort of go upon it, but do it one way or the other. And then you basically go again. And that's what we're going to do. Alright, just waiting to come through now. Here we go. And now, I could always put this in auto, but I tell you right now, I would not be confident whatsoever. Um, yeah, I would not be confident coming in here, leaving my guy, walking away, of course, and uh, leaving this on automatic. No way. I mean, as much as I have faith in my character here, and his um, equipment and everything else in between, I still don't trust it. You will definitely get bombarded here and you'll get absolutely demolished. The only time I actually really leave my my guy on automatic is if I'm basically um, in the green zones, really. Realistically just green zones, that's the only time that you'll see this, this guy here playing in auto, so I mean I can even do it with um, you know less weapons. I I think I've done it with the pepper box, I think it was. It's a pepper box, little to no armor, if anything at all. Just hit it on auto, leave it on, on the desk there, and do something else. And yeah, basically that's pretty much it. I just sort of, you know, run back and forth, you know, and I'll use that primarily if I want to sort of farm for, you know, basic logs and things like that. And I'm actually very low on supply logs, so I'm going to have to make a run out there soon. Because um, I need to get charcoal happening. Once I get charcoal, at least I can start cooking um, more steaks and things like that. Yeah. And let's just take you out. So yeah, as you can see, I'm actually collecting the tender steaks as well. Because I've got so much um, berries now, it's not funny. And now that they sort of, you know, um, gone a little bit easier on us with the recipe, we can actually craft as many steaks as we want quite easily, which is great. And that serves as 100 health, um, you know, so every time that you eat some, 100 health, away you go. You can't, you really, really can't go wrong with that. So yeah, highly recommended for a consumable item. If you want to use that, get yourself healed up. And it feeds you well as well, so if you're not, um, if you're getting hungry and things like that, you definitely want to go ahead and grab a steak. Oop. Let's just take you out once more. And you know what I didn't do? I didn't um, throw anything into the horse there, so we're going to have to do that later on I guess. But I think for now, we should be fine. And um, yeah. 
Let's just go over here. And let's make our way over here. What are we up to now? So that was the first three. Pretty much on my second stack of these guys. So let's just quickly finish it up. Take you out. Here we go. There's a few things here and there. Okay, and let's just grab some of the iron. Iron is going to be key, especially if you want to make um, steel. Uh, you're going to need iron. As much as you need chromite or uh, ore as well, you're going to need iron. And it's going to get very expensive. So, I guess in a way that's probably the developer's way of slowing down the game as well at the same time. Just a little bit. Just so we don't get too far ahead of ourselves. But if you guys are hardcore gamers playing this game, you guys are probably already there to be quite honest with you. And I, mean, I wouldn't be surprised if you weren't. Uh, if you were, if, I'll be very surprised if you wasn't, if you weren't, in a way, if all that makes sense. But if you if you sort of know what I'm sort of getting at, I'm just going to leave that over there for now. Because that is like a bonus to me. So let's just... Um, Grab all this, and we are on a stack here. Very good. Up, oh, agree. And play up seven nine six nine. Agree gives me that, and you don't give me much at all. I will leave you. Just use the bandage. Which the hell am I? levels here. Might as well just eat up a little bit, just get the, uh, the food and water index up. Okay, let's just take you out, there we go. And above all, how is the steel pickaxe doing? Not too bad. It's taking a bit of a beating, for, you know. Um, but otherwise, yeah, we're doing quite well with this, so we are pretty much on the way of to be honest with you. But, um, let's see where we're at. Okay, go. So I'm just going to pop that there anyway. It's quick enough, but that's okay. Let's just heal. Eat. Take you out. Oh, you did a decent hit on me. Hopefully there's some food about here that I can sort of eat and regenerate. Ooh, nice. Take some of that. Take some of that. Um, yeah, so I'm starting to low run, on, low, run low on reserves. Oh my god. No English here right now. Anyway, so let's um, run over here. Shall we drop some things off? I think we shall. And we'll get back to it, and hopefully we can, yeah, get some pretty decent heals. I need some heals. And any tick of the clock here. Oh, no, 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 what's happening? Didn't want to use any of that, but I had no choice. So that happened. Ah, uh, oh, you know why? Because I've got no pants, that's why. I just realised I I am pantsless, pantless. Yeah, no die wolf. Honestly, I don't think I'm gonna survive here. I'm gonna have to. Yeah, I'm out. 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 No, 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 no. Oh my god, are you serious? <laughs> oh my god, I've just lost a Confederate Sabre too. Yeah, that had actually happened. And this is what happens if you pick the cherry too much. Um, consequences. So yeah, I just lost all of that. 
um, I will not be able to go back up there and retrieve anything which is an absolute pain so the only thing that I would have retained is what's in the horse which is that so yeah uh, I have not done that in such a long time oh my god it's been so long since I've tied like that in a zone I uh, kind of forgot what it's what it's like to be honest but um, I've lost a confederate saber which is uh, no good whatsoever so yeah that's yeah anyway there's no point in dwelling on that um, what I'm trying to do now is I'm just trying to find oh I've actually ran out of uh, backpacks here we still have a ton of these things I've got the cloth backpack but I, I mean I know I can get there we go, the leather backpack. That's what I want. There we go, so I'll just equip that guy there and away we are. But that's going to go ahead and leave it. I just want to see where these things are at. Okay. So they're not too far away from being finished off and then basically we will use those in another adventure. But <laughs> for now, I think I'm going to have to leave it here because I'm not going to go chasing that. There's really no point. But that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed that one there. Uh, let me know down in the comment section down below what you thought about it. Hit the like button. Uh, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. All that sort of good stuff. Alrighty guys. Take it easy. And I will catch you next time.